Well, we are on the home stretch of our look back at Iowa's 2010 Orange Bowl team. Don't forget you can watch the entire Orange Bowl game Saturday night, 7 o'clock on the Quad City CW Channel 26.1. We are shifting gears today. We're going to check out the offense. Hawkeye headquarters reporter Adam Rosso tells us how a fast start was the catalyst for a big night in Miami. We knew we were going to get their best shot, but we also knew that we could Put a great product on the field. The Iowa offense had a quiet confidence entering the matchup with Georgia Tech. We knew we were better than their defense, right? We knew that we had an advantage on offense against their defense. An aggressive game plan made that even more apparent. Strike when we can, strike when we have the ball, put good drives together, um, get on the board early, and make them try to throw the ball. We knew if we could score on a certain number of possessions, we were going to have a certain number of points, and there was not going to be anything they could do about coming back. Two touchdowns in the first three possessions had the Hawks playing with a lead the entire game. It was just a case of kind of feeling out um, the, the X's and O's a little bit and picking our spots. And as soon as we got control and we saw how our defense was playing, it was kind of like, all right, let's just keep the foot on the gas pedal. This is working in our favor. And we just sort of rode that momentum all the way to the finish line. Ricky Stanzi completed his first eight pass attempts in that Orange Bowl. It was his first game action since injuring his ankle here at Kinnick in early November. Don't have any rust. Come out quick. Come out firing. Show them that, that your the ankle has nothing to do with anything. And I felt very good physically going into that game. An added boost for a unit that was galvanized all year long by its signal caller. Rick had whatever that intangible thing is that rallies other people together and gives them the confidence, you know, that leadership ability to give everyone the confidence that no matter what the situation was, we were going to be able to overcome that. The post-game celebration was surreal. You know, you're there, the confetti's flying, the, the hats are being handed out, you're chucking oranges into the stands. My whole family was there. Um, you're celebrating with your buddies. It's a it's sort of the exclamation point on a great season. Stanzi and the Hawks finished with over 400 yards of total offense in the win. The next season, he'd become the program's first starting quarterback to win three bowl games in a career, a feat equaled by Nate Stanley in 2019. Reporting from Iowa City, Adam Rosso for Hawkeye Headquarters.